Hi, I'm Arthur at Patterson Appliances in Knoxville. It's one of Patterson's five stores in eastern Tennessee. Today I'd like to introduce you to the Maytag laundry set. We have the Maytag washing machine that is a top load. We have the Maytag dryer. I'll specifically want to talk now about the washing machine, which is the model MVWB766FW. This has some very nice features besides being a very durable machine that's going to work very well at cleaning your clothes and will have good longevity. Of the different cycles that are available on this machine, we have certain ones that will preset the temperature, the soil level, the spin speed options that you can select. For example, if you want to use the bedding cycle, then it will operate, it will select all of the medium for temperature, soil level, spin speed, and it will automatically select deep fill option to ensure that you get enough water in the bedding. If you would use the auto sensing, because the bedding isn't heavy enough, it wouldn't think it would get enough water into it. So they would use the deep fill option. Of the different cycles that you overall have is you have a drain and spin. If you need to end the cycle, get the water out, drain the clothes, you can select that. You have the sanitize with oxy cycle. This is used if you want to use the oxy detergent for sanitizing clothes. It raises the temperature of the water and uses that detergent. The next one, as I touched on just a minute ago, was the bedding. You would use this for larger bedding that would want deep water fill. And colors. Colors, it will also go in and select the temperatures that it feels are best for colors in washing. You can always override these if you want. The next one is a power wash. The power wash is going to give you the extra agitation and the higher temperature in the wash for better cleaning. The next one would be a normal wash. In a normal wash then, you can select this with whichever temperature that you want, soil level that you selected, or spin speed. Then we have a cold water wash cycle. Again, this would set the temperatures for cold, and you would select the soil level or spin speed on this. The wrinkle control will help for eliminating wrinkles in your clothing as it will use different agitation speeds and temperatures of water to help eliminate wrinkles. Then you have the delicates, which would be uh, light agitation so that you don't damage your clothes. A rapid wash we have here that would be used for items that small loads that you need to wash quickly. In this case, normally a rapid wash is going to be around a half an hour or so. And something that we need to do on washing machines now is we need to clean our washing machines. Every 30 days or 30 loads, it's recommended that you use a fresh and that you run your clean washing cycle to make sure that the washing machine stays closed clean, doesn't get musty, etc. So I've been talking a bit about an agitator. This particular machine does have an agitator versus an impeller or wash plate that other models will have. This agitator, in my opinion, will do a lot better job of cleaning your clothes. It will move back and forth that will tumble your clothes to give them, in my opinion, a much better wash action than the top load without the agitator. Now I've been talking about some of the options that can be selected for different cycles. 
So in order for me to see a little better, I'll put my glasses on. The certain cycles come with the factory preset options on what you can have for temperature, soil level, etc. However, you can change any of these that you want to simply by going to temperature, for example. As you press the button, it will cycle through the different temperatures of water. Soil level, that would be the level of dirtiness of your laundry that you're putting in there. Again, you can cycle through it by constantly pushing, just touching the button, not pushing, as you go along. And the same thing for spin speed. If you don't want the washer to automatically sense the water level, you can always push the deep water fill to turn it on, and then it will give the most water available for the washing machine. One other thing is you also have a delayed start that you can set. If we look over here, we see the status of what's happening with the laundry. You can select from Oxy. You could do extra rinse. You could do deep clean. That will give you more agitation time, more cleaning. And this is to set the audio level of the push button. On the far right side, you will see indications of what's happening with the washing machine, lid lock, sensing, when it's sensing your load to determine how much water, when it's in the wash mode, the rinse mode, the spin mode, and when it's done, of course. After you have selected your cycle and all the options to that cycle, then you need to press and hold the start button for three seconds to begin washing. If at any time during the washing cycle you need to add another piece of laundry, you can then press the start pause button. The washing machine will go into a pause mode. After all movement has stopped in the machine, the lid lock light will go out. You can open the lid, put in the piece you forgot to put in, close it, the lid, and then press start again. So again, this was the Maytag washing machine MVWB766FW. Now we want to move on to the dryer that goes with the set. This is the Maytag MEDB766FW dryer. This dryer also has the steam option on it. It also has a number of different automatic cycles, and you can always use the timed dry cycle. This dryer has the lint screen on the top that you can pull out, and over the garbage, you would remove the lint, clean it up, slide it back into place. This dryer has a large door to make it easy to put things in and out of the dryer. Now we'll start talking about the controls. So on the control, because this is a steam dryer, we have the cycle of steam refresh. What the steam refresh will do is if you happen to have clothes that are clean but they're wrinkled, you're coming home from vacation, you have a lot of clean clothes left over that you stuffed in your suitcase, you get them back, you can select the steam refresh cycle, put your clothes in there, it uses steam and heat to get the wrinkles out so they're just like you washed and dried them. We also have next the sanitize cycle. This cycle will heat the temperature of the dryer sufficient to kill most household bacterias. We have the bedding cycle. The bedding cycle will 
be best used for large items such as bedding to give it the medium heat for drying and the good timing. We have the heavy duty cycle. The heavy duty cycle would be used for heavier things like jeans, heavy coats, and it's going to use your higher temperatures for drying. And then we have a normal cycle. The normal cycle you can go through and set whichever temperature you want for that, how dry you want it because this is going to be auto sensing. You can select if you want it to be real dry or still damp when you take them out of the dryer. And then you can turn wrinkle prevent on and off. And if I have wrinkle prevent on with steam, when it's dry, it will then cycle and give bursts of steam in to stop your dried clothes from wrinkling. Wrinkle control is for use while you're drying so that when it is done drying without wrinkle prevent turned on, you can take your clothes out and they will be wrinkle free and also they won't be as staticky. You have delicates cycle which would use lower temperatures and you want uh, normal dry level for that. And you have rapid dry, something for small loads that's going to use your higher heat level. And then you have the time dry. If you're going to use the time dry, you can select how much time you want by hitting the plus and minus buttons at the top. Again, with each of these, you can select your static reduce, your damp dry signal, and your audio level. While the dryer is running, the lights will tell you where it's at in its cycle. This is the Maytag laundry set with the Maytag washer model MVWB766FW and the dryer model number MEDB766FW. You can see these at any of our five Patterson stores throughout East Tennessee or online at pattersonsappliances.com.